holy toy boy, despite late and wrong report. Drake is not Angelina Jolie's new toy boy, despite a late and wrong report that asserts he could become the daddy of the actress's six children. Gossip Cop can once again correct this off-base claim that maintains there's a real possibility Holy will give in to her kids' wishes to date Drake. The bogus story was first manufactured by an unreliable website and now a tabloid has picked up the untrue tale and embellished it even more. According to the new issue of the Australian version of OK, Holy's oldest two sons Maddox and Pax keep betting Angelina to date Drake. Now, maintains the publication from down under. There's a real possibility the humanitarian may just give in. But it's all untrue, and it simply started last month when Dre posted a photo of himself on Instagram sitting alone at a table, along with a caption that jokingly hinted how Jolie stood me up. And while most outlets took the photo in the humorous vein in which it was intended, Hollywood Life took the opportunity to make up a fake news story about Jolie's kids wanting her to date Dre because it would be the coolest thing. But as Gossip Cop previously noted, the original piece by Hollywood Wise, as it's known, was a complete fabrication. The claim about Jolie's two oldest sons pushing her to date Drake was made up. And the quotes from a supposed source were also concocted. At the time, the real Jolie insider assured us, none of it is true. Shockingly, though, the Australian tabloid took the manufactured Hollywood life tale and added more phony aspects to it. On its cover, the magazine exclaimed, OMG! He's in love, with an arrow pointing to Drake. And under a photo of Holy and daughter Shiloh rather than sons Maddox or Pax the publication wrote, Angel's toy boy, Daddy Drake see below. Of course, Holy isn't going to date Drake, and the only joke bigger than the rapper's Instagram photo about him being ditched by the actress is OK. Itself. In a desperate effort to bolster its fabricated premise about Drake pursuing Holy, the publication quotes the singer stating in an interview more than a decade ago, I love older women. Still, Gossip Cop once more fact-checked the story and again we were told in no uncertain terms that it's untrue. Interestingly, the Aussie magazine makes no mention whatsoever about Holly and Pitt spending Christmas together, an inaccurate claim made by that same outlet two weeks ago. The tabloid asserted the estranged spouses felt celebrating together was the best thing they could do for their kids. Much like how that story was 100% wrong, its new article about there being a real possibility that Drake could become Jolie's toy boy is equally false.